Hey guys, welcome back to Exploration Plate. We're going to announce the winners to the Pillow Fort STEM Challenge today. But let's talk a little bit about the challenge first. We asked you guys to build a pillow fort with your families and get super creative with it. And let me tell you, you guys did amazing. And if yesterday, if you tuned in, you saw that we had our face off where two of our educators, Erica and Josh, went fort to fort in a battle to see who had the best aim and could take down the other team's knights. So we're gonna go to Erica and she's gonna tell us a little bit about how her fort won and the science behind that projectile motion. <laughs> Hello explorers, welcome to Exploration Place. So yesterday I built my fort. You guys saw that I protected more of the perimeter, but what I did was I built it out. So I wanted to make sure my walls were nice and thick because back in medieval times, that's what they would do. They would try to protect against cannonballs and things thrown from catapults. They'd want to make their walls nice and thick so that those couldn't um, penetrate through. Uh, those forts were built for castles to protect them. They also had really big watchtowers, so sometimes they could tell, there goes my crown, dang it! <laughs> but they wanted to protect against um, any intruders. So I am so excited with all of your submissions. So thank you guys so much. All right, so this week we had five judges. And our judges were Logan from Education, Joe from the store, Nicole, our reservationist, Chelsea from Visitor Services, and Ian, our technology specialist. So big round of applause to our judges for helping us out and choose, because you guys, it was so hard. I know I say that every week, and every week it gets more challenging to be able to judge you guys, because you step it up every week, and the submissions were so great. Are you guys ready to hear the winners? All right. So in third place, we have Bogner Castle. So congratulations, Bogner family. Bogner family. And in second place, we have Rylan Perkins, who had an outdoor fort. And in third place, we have the Patty Family Kingdom. First place, first place, we have the Patty Family Kingdom. And so big round of applause to you guys. We will be uh, contacting you guys through Facebook Messenger, but don't forget to tune in tomorrow because we are so excited to announce our next STEM challenge. And in fact, we are bursting with excitement. So we'll see you guys then, and have a great day. Guys, me. Bye, guys. We have been here for all day. <laughs>